Hi guys, so we have a Trinergy solar inverter here and while I was fixing it I understood that I do not understand how, how, how should it operate what should happen when um, the grid line is connected or when the solar panels are connected and so on so I decided to show um, some information about it and about the operation so uh, what happens if you connect the uh, solar inverter to the grid to the 220 line it is important to know uh, when you are repairing such things and I have just connected uh, the grid line 220 and what happens it's nothing nothing at all and now I will connect uh, solar panels without connection to the grid it, it blinks the LCD has blinked and uh, you start to hear the uh, transformator noise from there and then it starts and gives the error that utility loss as we have no uh, grid connected to the line uh, now I have a grid line connected and we start connect, connecting the, the solar panels the, the relay has clicked another relay you, you hear the transformator noise relay keeps keep clicking it, it counts down the seconds while it will connect uh, to the to will generate uh, energy from solar panels to to the grid another relies clicking and then it shows normal status and uh, how much energy it puts to the grid now while it is operating I will disconnect the grid line immediately we see error utility loss and red light turn on, turns on now I will connect grid line back It starts to count. Some relays are cl clicking. And again, normal operation. It starts to to put energy to the grid. Now, while it is in normal operation, we will disconnect solar panels. The uh, generation drops, and it stays in the normal condition normal status with the green light ok the button operation mm, how much power it, it has put to, to the grid 0 per today total MPPT input uh, voltage 
which we put from the solar panels. And uh, current from one and from another MPPT input. Um, current of the AC line, frequency of the AC line, model SGN 4000 TL, not 126 version, language, and then this is AC line voltage. Another thing is that uh, even you disconnect the grid, for example, I will disconnect the grid now, then I disconnect the solar panels, and it keeps, keeps working from the capacitors for the long time. and its capacitor is discharged so it uh, works from capacitors more than half a minute or, or even more uh, and about the damage um, uh, how it burned um, as you may see it is rated for 580 uh, volts and uh, uh, somebody put uh, about 700 volts to the solar input here uh, and what has happened um, it burned a lot um, the arc has burned the PCB I cleaned it and it seems it works. Another thing, um, if you do not know what you are doing, please do not try to repair such or similar things, because there is a really, really high voltage. Uh, for example, even on the tests, in, in those capacitors, I have uh, more than 300 DC volts, which is very dangerous and the grid grid line is 220 AC it is also dangerous <laughs>